Rob is a lot better suited. I feel Rob would be the safe bet in okay, this matchup. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's fair. I, I wouldn't say a it's a complete. Though. I wouldn't say it's a full. Maybe I'll give it like. Oh, okay. Seven, oh my okay, God. okay. Right, no, I would say it's a safe bet. Never mind. I would say That's he does pretty, 20, pretty well. Like, this <laughs> that bull. I wasn't going to give it that deep, but okay there. At nine? Was that at four? That, that was, was like at that four, was something. bro. Justin Jeez, taking this, looking at it, saying, hey, you know what? If I'm gonna, uh, if I have to fight Isabel and deal with the shenanigans, I don't I'm know this do matchup. It. I don't need to know the matchup. I'm gonna go in and just play my Rob game. It works. It's working out just fine. Sub, or, or actually over 50 as of right now, able to get that 21 locked in. Gonna just try to accumulate as much more as they can. Gotta try to find an approach for this back air there. And there is gonna be the answer. We'll add in the fair with a couple tilts with that throw. And Sacks back in that danger zone. And that down there definitely can rip through. Um, Sax is recovering. Oh yeah, it's gonna be doing so much work. Coming home with that up air there too. Again, the aggression from Justin doing him so well right now. Ooh, that laser get through patience. that there. Again, there you go, the patience, like you said exactly. Sax here still trying to sit up there. But the Lloyd Rocket catching mm. that aggression on. That fishing rod's actually gonna be a big detriment for Justin coming back on the stage. Okay. Oh man. As I say that too. Just to oh. shield right through it. Get oh, oh. nice, yeah, as I a say nice that. answer. On the uh, recovery there, too. The up air is going to finish it and find the second stock there um, for uh, Johnson Gamer. As he continues moving forward on this onslaught. 3 1 as of right now. 130, though. So Sachs is should definitely be able to find a pretty decent reset here and uh -oh. at least make it a 2 1. Yeah, Justin keeping Ooh. the aggression up there, trying to delete that stock off the Isabel. Nice. Call nice, that, with the nice. Rob, but that up throw is going to do it. Yeah, just kind of play, getting into his, his, the zone, playing his game. Tax Slayer, of course, trying to find that there, too. Oh, going to catch that fishing rod there again. Down throw into a four air comes out. Trying to keep that pressure up. Keep him at bay. Bring around that da uh, back air. And the big Got call out again. On See you later. Okay, My that favorite is a thing, safe bet for sure. I think the funniest thing about some characters in this game, there's kind of just like, uh, there's a lot of skip characters in this game. They kind of just like, they look at a character, right? Like Josh Jingle, he's just, Isabel. I don't know how to fight Isabel. What does Isabel do? I don't, I'm not sure. Wait, like, wait, I'm playing Rob. Yeah. I can just skip all of this. I don't need to look. I can feign ignorance <laughs> and just kind of just play my game and kind of like just character diff you. That and is just true. do my thing. And that's exactly what he did there. He, he broke right through the Deleted those stocks to the side special. And he looks so stressed. He, he, he's, you know what? It's a hot, it, it, it's a hot day. I feel that. All right, I Get feel this that. man a water bottle, bro. For sure, man. My man looking super stressed over there. You should be feeling a little good about yourself. That was a pretty decent uh, <laughs> win there for top 16. That recovery, though, was a little sus. <laughs> oh, we're not going to find those down tilts there either. Sack Slayer trying to start a game with a more of an aggressive approach, saying, realizing that Justin kind of went on a tear last game and trying to find some uh, some offensive plays of his own. Big uh, Lloyd Rocket there, too. Justin playing around that down tilt. Oh, the air getting to the ooh, other side of the stage. Ooh. There we go. Nice escape there. He's going to find a recovery there, too. Tilt is going to find its mark, plus the up air conversion. Going to be some decent damage. But Dallas here, he's going to find a meaner conversion, and that's going to be the kill. There we go. Good stuff there from Chashitan. That back air is going to come out. Avoiding that laser there, too. Trying to get back on the stage. Taxus Slayer trying to get, uh, trying to catch that aggressive. Deck. There we go. There Catching is. that aggressive landing. Seeing he's getting a little too comfortable finding that uh, punish there at the end. That was a decent reset there for Sax there. Uh, Josh and up one as of right now, but it is tied game two right now. Sax just, I just think, uh, needs to continue the pressure here. Keep finding those marks there. Um, but again, it's just kind of the same story as it was uh, the first match we saw him. The trade's just really not working out on the favor. Mm -hmm. Back air does land, but then Justin does find the approach and just gets so much more than uh, just a one-hit uh, one trade. Finding the trip there again with the down tilt. Justin keeping the insane aggression off stage, catching that jump in again with the down tilt. No downer to come out there again. Avoiding oh, that S match no. there too. Big up tilt pressure on the on the Ooh, there we nice. go on the shield. There it is. Up air might do it, and it is going to do it on Hollow Bastion. Justin does playing that game so well right now. Insane there. Doing his thing. Doing his thing. Beautiful work there. Coming back from neutral fishing rod is finally going to land again for Sax. Does have the rocket? No, rocket is actually gone there. Not gonna land. Unfortunate down throw is going to land though on the other side there for Gamer. Back air trade. 
doing some hit and run, some guerrilla warfare tactics, but it's just not enough. These trades really not sticking over for Sacks there. Fishing Rod is going to toss up, but the gyro plus tilt at the jabs. Going to put Sacks in a scary position. Reverse snare. Oh, the reverse oh, gyro. The there we gyro? go. Gonna catch all the way out there. Oh, oh the balloon! Oh, that's disrespectful. You popped his balloons! And then just left them hanging there. He stole his balloons that's on Furry up. Balloon Day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, bro. Well, he robbed him there. Look at that. She oh, said, oh, no. Look, he said, bye. <laughs> <laughs> bye, have a wonderful time. Like. <laughs> Justin playing this matchup so well. Oh, yeah. The aggressive Rob play is bringing it home for him. And we're bringing this into a game three. Justin up 2-0. Bringing this back to Hollow Bastion, Saxa player. We just need, like, we either to match John's energy right now or just, like, and set up on stage even more to kind of, like, you're getting, the calls you're getting are really good, right? Catching mm -hmm. the landings with the Lloyd Rockets and the Fisher Run have been good. But you're just kind of, like, go. every time you overextend, you find, you find something really bad predicament. And Justin, we're seeing right here in the beginning, you're not overextending. You're playing your game. This, this is what you need. Play your game. Now. Yes. Play your game. There you go. Saxa Slayer looking like a Saxa mm, player right now. There we nice. go. There Doing we his go. thing. Two, oh, but you wouldn't think of it after seeing that play there. Saxa finally finding their mark there. And it just needs to continue that guerrilla warfare, that hit and run tactics. Once uh, Johnson tries to find their way in, push them back and make sure that those back airs are landing. Gotta watch those with fishing rods there. Those are big punish. Gyro is in hand. He's gonna be able to finally stack a little bit of damage here. But Johnson in a deep deficit right now. Oh, not gonna find that landing there. To Ground. a gyro. Back Ooh, comes out there though. Oh, again, getting a little aggressive there with the side special. Sax Slayer now, I'm liking much more of this uh, defensive approach, seeing that Jocelyn's going to get it. We know Jocelyn's going to be mm -hmm. aggressive. Oh, Just yeah. taking a step back, setting up with your Lloyd Rockets again. Dash not going to be doing a lot there on the platform, too. Oh, Gyro in the pocket now. Yes. That's going to be, that's going to suck for That was a though. nice catch there, too. In the, in the back pocket for later. This is a surprise tool we can help, that can help us later. <laughs> it's a secret mascot tool, baby. <laughs> Lloyd is just gonna barely whiff there. Oh, oh no, I thought he was that. safe there. No shield either. Oh, oh gosh. Locked up. It's still gonna need the life Trying there. to rob the balloons. Oh my god, still robbed the life though. But was able to stack up to 67. So it's not the end of the world there. It wasn't a fresh reset there. Not even close by a long shot. Sacks getting right back into the groove there. Nice pocket there. Gonna be able to get the big laser there and just keep on the onslaught there. Oh, catching that jump there against Saxa, you're doing a fantastic mm -hmm. job now of just staying in his lane. You can, a lot of people too, they, they kind of like, they start winning interactions, and they get super over aggressive. Yes. Now Saxa is saying, I'm Isabel. I need to take a step back and just back air you. That's do it. Do the thing I do well. That's it. And he's doing it great right now. Really nice work. Even blocking gyros a couple times too. Time oh. to stop. No, time for side B, unfortunately. Dallas is just going to keep the air. Going to guard it as hard as he can. And oh, Moe's going to take those balloons yet again. Ooh. Nice Almost pocket. Fine. That was, was the same, but still going to get that gyro into his pocket again. I find the fall there too. Justin going to catch that jump there with an up air. Just there trying to find the landing. Nice space is going to be so Ooh. hard in this matchup. Ooh. Ooh, still going to catch that spot dash with an F smash. That was a really scary interaction there between both players. Sax is going to find its mark there. Push back. Ooh, no no tech, but going to get up late there. Nice tilt there. Oh, not going to find that pass throw, unfortunately, just barely within the grab. Joshin trying to flip the stock at 148. Sax Slayer with the gyro in hand. He does not have the gyro to get open up, but this down throw, Grounding. we're seeing up. To, oh, oh Ooh. nice delayed mash. It's huge. That was big there. Sax Slayer playing fantastically in defensive right now. He's really starting to feel comfortable, a lot more comfortable in this matchup. Nice laser to get rid of the rocket to uh, clear the approach there. Dallas looking good. Oh, but the pivot grab. Not going to be enough, though. Really close, though. Going to chase out for it. Just need a fair to land. Just need a fair to stick. Need a down air. Oh, my gosh. Sacks living right now. 146 in the dream. Time to stop. Let's go. You hear the crowd popping off for the doggo. There we go. The New England boys are popping off for Sacks Slayer right now. We're going to find that backer and send nice it straight reset. up. Okay. <laughs> Justin now even the stock of the last socks and era. He, he he wants he's he's tired of playing neutral with his belt. Yeah. He wants to take the stock with a nair into gyro train. Yep. We know exactly what he wants. Yep. Rob players want one thing. And one it's thing disgusting. Only. <laughs> Here we go. Back throw. But the oh, Lloyd the Rocket's rocket. gonna hold them off. There we go. Trying to push away. Trying to go uh -oh. for it. There it is. Uh -oh. oh my gosh. 
So you gotta be careful here. Rock going out there. Oh, Ooh, nice dodge. That was so scary. They already got to the uh, already accumulated 71 damage. Time to stop those sacks. Trying to put a stop to this 3-0. Oh my gosh, this is getting close. Nice fishing rod there. Gonna block out the rocket with the gyro. Uh, empty, not an empty there because it was blocking um, the slingshot there, the marble. So, oh no, tech there, Ooh, just to find no the down check. throw. Gonna up wait, tilt. gonna get Into the tilt. Up here. Lot nice safer. DIY though. Oh, but spot dodge, baby. Let's Big go. call out there on the up smash. There you go. Sassa Keeping Slayer. himself alive there. Yeah, this is what we this is what we like to talk about a lot. Yeah. Right. Of just like trying to uh, people getting really comfortable and trying to do things that they can. Right. Like Isabel cannot do the same thing Rob mm -mm. does. Rob is really good at what he does. He's the best at what he does. So Isabel, you got to stick to what you can do best, and that's playing defensively. Playing your game, and it's just step back, set a rocket, back air, back air, nice back air. There playing with the patient. reversal, patient neutral game, pa playing lame wins games. I Straight hear that. Up. I hear that. That's real, and that's what's gonna close it out for him. Great stuff to Sax Slayer taking that game number three. There, we're going right into game four on PS2. Change the scenery there. Good call from Justin. I think this was a great call here for Justin. That was gonna actually be my next question. Was it, uh, what's the stage that really gave it over to Sax? I think was the hardest thing. Was it Bastion, thing, really? Was it a Bastion div? I think it, it like the hardest thing with Joshin is like his recoveries were limited because he didn't have those side, those side platforms to come back from. Right? Because like he had to interact with the Lloyd Rocket and uh, Sax Slayer on Legend. He had to. Because there's only one platform to deal with on Hollow Bastion. With two platforms on PS2, his recoveries become so much Whoa! bigger and the off stage game gets so much See harder for Sax Slayer. What? So much harder. Swinging over there. Mm -hmm. Big arm swinging over there. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? 104 is stacked up um, for Sack. So he should be able to get a decent reset here um, as long as he finds a proper approach to it. But Johnston feeling a lot more comfortable oh. on PS2 and almost got it again there. Got to watch those balloons. Going to stay under the... Oh! Okay. Okay. Nice He's tired. tired of those rock down I hear that. I got a down of my own. Oh, oh, but Josh look for the burner booster. Whoa! He's gonna find that there. A wow. little bit delayed, but a burner booster nonetheless. That was sick. Going super all the way out there with that back air, reminiscent of Samba, because we're in New York. Oh my gosh, Good stuff man. There, Josh, that was then. sick. The approach here from both sides is insane. Nice, decent combo over from Sack. Gonna get the big laser. Ooh. Gonna reverse card as well. He said, give me that. Ooh, but Dallas coming up there with their own. From platform, nice there. Gonna push forward. Gyro pocket. No! Oh, oh my the pop gosh! Up again. Oh, still gonna find that. Mashing out of the grab there. Josh looking to find the pickup. Sack Slayer on last sock, fighting for his tournament life right now because this is loser's bracket. One. That's it! Oh, and gonna connect on Isabel. Down here, going to actually spike that time. This man robbed him twice uh -huh. there. Check that, check that, check that. Wah, boom, wah, see wah, ya. Wah, wah. Wah, wah. I do like the hang there and the reversal back with uh, Sacks. The Karma Ledge Tunks are definitely coming around in full circle here. Yeah, See, like, that burner boost was sick, I will dude. say, though, game three, I love the adaptation from Sax Slayer. Yes. Right? The way that he was able to do his thing mm. super well, taking mm. the defensive play back, and, <laughs> and the, do the Isabel things just when he need to. Right? It's just Josh then bringing that back to PS2. He's going where he's comfortable in a place where he knows he can not only do uh, find his Rob shenanigans more offstage easier, but have those platforms to kind of just negate a lot of that ledge trapping coming out from Isabel. Makes it I feel so that. Because that Rob can just kind of skip a step there. Without the platform there, he can't skip a step. And that's what made game three so much harder. Yeah. But that's why he looks so comfortable in game four. All the full trades there, too, were just landing um, as we get ready to set up so we don't have to stare into the depth.